Hey guys, um, this is M Mrs. Skane Watch, and if you haven't seen the Lost episode, which I recommend you um, kind of watch it, but yet you shouldn't, but I put it up there anyway. Um, this is a uh, truly welcome back to Pokemon Yellow Version. Mrs. I am your host for this gameplay, Mr. Skane Watch, and right now, if you haven't seen the last episode, um, you kind of didn't miss anything. Um, all we did was, like, um, go to the f south of Fuchsia City, um, Fuchsia City, where the next route to the, um, s um, city is, and that is Sea Route 19, and we will go to Seaform Islands after this next one, which is not this. This is actually a little mini game that I, that I discovered, and if you saw the last episode, the lost episode of that you would um, probably know about it I got so surprised when I realized this was a mini game for Pikachu and I really was amazed so w before I do anything else I'm gonna just start off by doing this and then we'll go to the power plant um, where we can get the uh, legendary Pokemon wanna go surf? heck yeah this is the most funnest thing I ever did. Oh, god dang it, that's not. Here we go. Dang it. I'm trying to make it do a double backflip. Ooh, got it! Got it again. Got it again. Got it again. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Oh, messed up. Sorry if I'm a little um, quiet. I'm kind of tired. Yeah, I got it. This would be like my best score. Yep, this is my new high score. <laughs> now, it's kind of funny on how they have a points for like the HP, which I don't really care. But I'm kind of laughing so hard that the bonus point is on Radness, on how great Pikachu's skill is while he does backflips, which is kind of funny, so yeah. <laughs> anyway, that's it. I wanted to show you guys that, and I wanted to show you another Pikachu that is not the same Pikachu that I have with me, because my Pikachu would like tell me what's up, you know. Anyway, this is what the, this Pikachu looks like. See, it just does the original voice, like the original like chip sounds, like any other Pokemon, but like it's kind of different than my Pikachu. Anyway, let's see how my Pikachu is doing. <gasps> That's not good. I think we gotta take him to the Pokemon Center. Oh wow, I didn't realize that. Well, um, I think there's some wrong, like, if, um, if my Pikachu keeps failing and the health goes down, I think that's why it has the HP. Uh, I should have thought of that. Anyway, let's heal my Pikachu back up to make it feel better. Because I think it's been wiped out a lot of times. Well, not a lot. <laughs> kind of better than my, my last run. But anyway... Let's see how my Pikachu is doing now. Yep, he's happy. He just had a little bit of a wipeout and embarrassment. Anyway, what I think I'm going to do right now is we're, we're going to go fly to... 
We're gonna go to Sulean City. And take a short way. Hold on, let me use my bicycle. And then get the Charmeleon to use Cut. And no, I did not check on my Zubat in a long time, ever since I dropped him to the, um, to, to the daycare. Because screw Zubat, right? I'm just going to wait until, like, it gets to that point where I can just level it up and evolve. Because I don't really do Zubats. They're basically one of the most annoying, um, creatures in Pokemon. Because you're always in the cave and they just attack you. <laughs> And it's kind of annoying. Anyway, I'm trying to skip through these people so I can get to my destination, which is right here. And if you haven't seen my last episode, I already been here. It's just that I didn't get all the way through because my Pikachu got easily defeated somehow. Got defeated, and I didn't get any um, supplies for like healing my Pokemon. And now I do. So, yeah. All my Pokemon's healed. Um, I saved the, I'm gonna save the game um, when I walk in there. I already fought this guy. See? Because I had a feeling he was gonna fight me. So, here we are. And what we are going to do, we are going to catch this legendary Pokemon. And it's one of the legendary bird Pokemon. And since it's the electric, it's a power plant kind of thing thing an abandoned an abandoned warehouse to be exact um you guys should already know who this pokemon is if you're a pokemon at heart and i almost forgot to mention that most of my pokemon is becoming stronger than ever and i also got like a couple of other pokemon like jatini i finally got a jatini which is a dragon type and that would be great for me when i get to the elite four so i can use a dragon type against a dragon type <laughs> So let's save it right here. I got my supplies. I got the escape rope in case if I need to go to the Pokemon Center. And here goes our first Pokemon of this episode. The Wild Grimer appeared. Hit him with a thunderbolt. Mm. Pikachu, as always, is stronger than a Stronger than ever. Oh yeah, and by the way, I forgot to mention that in my last episode that I talked about all the items I got. And I also brought an experience all since I got over 50 kinds of Pokemon um, to Professor Oak's aid. And so I'm using that to like easily get my all my party Pokemon to experience faster without trying to bring them out of their Pokeballs to fight. And also, in case this something like this happens, I would, like, use Repel. I have a couple of Repels. Let's see if I have it right now. Yeah, I got Super Repel, and I got four of them. So, what I'm going to do is use Super Repel and save right here. In case if I mess up, which I highly doubt I would. So what I'm gonna, this is basically like a maze, which I highly recommend not to like take your time on. And then there are like Pokeballs around here, but don't get fooled by one of them because one of them is gonna be a, uh, I would say a not an electrode, but another Poke. Well, you know what I mean. It's like the original Pokemon before Electrode. I forgot its name. It's not Magnemite, because that's the other Pokemon. Anyway, um, so what we're going to do is go through it. I'm not going to pick any of these, because I can do that later after this episode. Okay, that's a trap. Alright, let's save it right here, because I think I messed up. 
And also, I am watching. I'm listening to something in the background. If in case if you guys hear it. Okay, the repel wore off. So what I'm gonna do is save the game and let's see. Oh, I forgot to put on repel. Oh, Voltorb. Yeah. If if I make the wrong step on cat on getting a Pokeball on the ground, it could be an, a Voltorb, and it will attack me. Okay, we're almost there. Already got that Pokemon. Because as I said, um, in my last episode, I ended it off by getting attacked in the what you call. Alright, let's save it right here, because I don't know which way to go. And hold on, let me fix my camera so you people can see. Hold on, give, give me a minute. Alright, let's keep it like this. And then raise the volume up a little bit. Anyway, so this should be our way. Which is not. And I keep forgetting to put on the re repel. But you know what? It doesn't matter. We can get through this. I have a feeling that my Pikachu is going to easily destroy Zapdos, probably. Cause it's the Zapdos is like a level 50 Pokemon, so it should be immensely strong. This should be where we encounter the Zapdos, and in my opinion, I would say on my top three legendary birds, I would say like my first one. It's a big debate. I mean, it's a big debate between um, Articuno and Zapdos because I like electric types, but Articuno is like more majestic type, and you can't really argue with that. So I would say, like, in my opinion, Zapdos should be like number one. Oh wait, is this it? It's been so long. Okay, yeah, here we go. This is Zapdos right here. So here we get our Zapdos. I have a feeling that I'm not going to catch it because I only got like six more Pokeballs, Ultra Balls left. So it's not going to be that easy. That will be great. It will be great if it was. Anyway, so here we have the Zapdos in all its glory. So without further ado, let's kick its butt and catch it. Here we go. The wild Zapdos appeared. See, as I predicted, Zapdos is on a, is on a whole nother level. And I'm not surprised. Now let's fight fire with fire. Or in my case or in this case, electricity with electricity. Super effective, are you can oh yeah, it's also a flying type. Since it's a bird Pokemon, it's also a flying type. Just hang on, Pikachu. We're gonna catch it. Let me use my Super Potion on my Pikachu so it doesn't fall. So that's what Zapdos is going to do. He's going to use Thundershock and some other move that I don't know. And we're going to hit him with one more Thunderbolt without having any critical damage. And then we're going to start catching it. Because I want it on like the decent kind where you can like easily catch it. Alright. Let's do this. I missed the Pokeball. 
and my Pikachu died. I didn't mean to. If I if I let this Pokemon if I escape, my Pokemon is gonna this Pokemon Zapdos is gonna be gone for good. I can't let that happen. I can either just keep throwing the Pokeballs at it, but it keep missing, and I don't like that. Dude, it quickly defeated my Charmeleon, like, in a flash. Alright, hold on. Can't do that, can't do that. Let's do Ivysaur. Let's do Ivysaur, revive my Pikachu. And of course, you would do that. It's probably gonna be, yep. Yep, super effective. Ivysaur fainted. I'm gonna use this. Pick out Pikachu. Put on some Super Potion. And then we're gonna hit him one more time and then make the shot. Let's just hope it's not strong enough to kill him or take him out. Okay, it's good. We're good. Thank God it's on a league of its own. Critical hit. Not very effective. Doesn't matter. We're gonna do this and then we're gonna start catching Zapdos. <sighs> but it keeps doing that and it's so annoying. Just like stop attacking. Alright, that's good. We should be able to do this. Ultra Ball. But I still missed! This is gonna be annoying. It's not gonna let me catch it! Why can't it let me catch it? I'm sorry, Jutini. You're gonna have to be the next victim. Because I ain't gonna stop until I catch this dang Pokemon. I'm sorry! He's just too powerful. Oh, that would be amazing if he was at 1% of his health. So, what I'm gonna plan on doing is just do that and just throw the Pokeball at him. Just screw it. We only got two Pokeballs left. And it's not going to do anything about it. We only got one shot left. And it still didn't work. This is ridiculous. We just ran out of Pokeballs. <sighs> hold, on, hold on guys, I'm going to have to restart this game and get back to where we started. And I will be right back. Okay, guys, we are back. Um, I only have one to two options right now. I can either go back and um, train my Pokemon more. Or I can go against Zapdos right now again. And just don't hit him. Just throw Pokeballs at him as much as I can. That's my option. So let's go with the second option first. And if that doesn't work, I'm going to have to cut this video off so I can um, train my Pokemon. Either that or like give it Sand Attack or something to like keep it loose, to make it lose its um like little power, you know, and attack and try weaken it. So let's kick things off right now. This is the second try. My apologies for being quiet. I'm a little frustrated right now about catching this one. I was really anticipating by catching Zapdos and this is not how I expect it. And Pikachu died. 
Okay. Alright. Let's see what Ivysaur has that I can use. It has Leech Seed and Poison Powder. Let's do that. Poison Powder. As long as I don't die? Yeah, I'm gonna die anyway. It was a flying type. Yep. And I know I'm gonna die by War Turtle. So what I'm gonna do is revive Pikachu. Not surprised on that part. Don't do that. Wait. I could do that. I could, but he's going to attack me first. So I'm just going to do this. My Jutili doesn't help stand a chance against Zapdos at this minute. So let's bring it back with Pikachu. Ultra Ball. I still missed. I think the only chance to catch it is by weakening it. And I should have done that. Oh my gosh, come on. It won't let... Yeah, it won't let me. It's not gonna let me catch it. Like, is there some kind of certain amount to weakness I have to give out to this Pokemon? Of course, that's going to take me out. And let me use my Charmeleon. I highly doubt that it's going to stand a chance. Let's use Rage. I was about to say, just by one hit. And then I'm done. What I'm going to do, I'm going to fight back and slam him. Give him... Nah, that's not going to be good enough because then he's going to attack me by Trill Pack and I'll probably die. I'm going to hit him by thunder. Maybe this would be good. I don't know. Just a little bit of a theory. Come on, Zapdos. Get in the Pokeball. I mean, Ultra Ball. Nope, that didn't work. Ugh. Scorch him by a Thunderbolt. He's gonna finish me off, watch. Yep, I knew it. Yep. Didn't really matter anyway. Didn't matter. I'm gonna reset that. Um, this is gonna be a tough battle, so I think what I am going to do, I'm going to get a move on one of my Pokemon, possibly Pikachu, to, um, or probably train one of my Pokemon who has, like, a legitimate, um, power to, like, weaken, um, this Pokemon, 
which is um really hard to do. It's gonna take some time. So what I'm gonna do is just do that. Yeah, just train or like get a move to weaken Zapdos. Not how I expected it was gonna happen. Um, going against a legendary bird type, but what? I'm not surprised. Probably because I need more um ultra balls. Probably because I need a big level for Pikachu. I don't know. I'm just gonna like train and practice until the next episode. So, so we're gonna stop it right here. Yeah, that's gonna be the end of this episode. Um, it's been a good episode. Um, we progressed a lot. Even and I showed you what was going on. Even though, in case you guys didn't like the lost episode part. So if you do like this episode, hit that like button and um. If you want to see more of this, you can subscribe to my channel and and um, like my and add my playlist to your channel to watch more of it. And if you want to and tell me and leave a comment on what do you think about this video. And I'm gonna be and yeah, it's been that's this is a tough one. I'm so, I'm sorry. This is this is like a tough battle. And I, and I can't, I mean, it's easy to defeat the Zapdos, but it's really hard to, like, catch, but I don't want to defeat it, I want to catch it, I want to catch them all. So, if you guys like this video, yeah, just hit that like button, subscribe if you want to watch more, leave a comment on what you think, and I will be seeing you guys in the next episode. Laters!